Hey everybody, welcome back to the shop. Ten more minutes of Bob TV. Broadcasted in Philo Vision. Oh yeah, it's, we're still drama free too. A little bit. Anyway. <laughs> Alright. Okay, I got my the box bar trimmed down. Got it ready to glue in. So we're going to mix this up to meat boxing. My stash go. Can't forget the stash. Oh yeah. Can't forget the stash. That's the most important part. Okay, let's mix this up a little gob. Here on a Sunday, man, I got storms blowing through every couple of hours. It's kind of been like this. Oh, weekend, windy, can't go flying. I'm going to get a flight on my T-45. Got my gear doors all working now. And man, wind's just blowing about every couple of hours. Storm will blow through. Some vicious ones the past couple of days. It was raining hard, man. It drops this big. Right. Pay attention, guys. Watch those big old feet. Now, we want to get this all smeared up. Do this side first. We don't want to overdo it. Get glue and out of it. Down to the process. Man, I was just in the middle, in the mood to build a kit like this. We did one like this in a long time. Oh, it's something more special about an airplane you do like this, even though it ain't mine, you know. It's my buddies. No, you can see it all the time. I don't know, I might need to get to grab the sticks now and then. But, can't knock them arms too much, though. So it's pretty nice, man. I'm gonna have a plane flying in a couple days. Even though when I get to building on something, it don't take me that long either. I know you guys are thinking, ain't no way he's going to be painting that plane in a week. <laughs> you guys just sit back and watch. Alright. Alright, now we're going to spread this part just a little bit. Get it in there without scraping a little bit of epoxy off. Okay. Not bad. Only scraped a little. Okay, that looks good. That looks good to me. Okay. Oh, that's beautiful. 
That's just beautiful right there. is very little okay when I set my put my set screw in right here it's going to want to push them rods that way so I want a little bit of a gap there just a tiny one not very much and that will suck her all down perfect got the plan anyway uh, it'll work a lot of airplanes in my days, people. A lot. Love these box bars. What you thinking? Well, that sure looks ugly now, but when this plane's finished, you never know it was there. You know, it, the instructions are pretty vague. It uh, really don't tell you what to do here. You know, I don't know if someone that was to just glue them rods in that foam, I don't think that would hold. So this is probably what he's got figured for this. But that's what I did. So you guys see the glass and you people that ain't seen it, a fiberglass technique, that is the best thing you will ever learn from any one of my videos. So all you new guys, get ready. I'll show you how to glass fiberglass for an airplane. Wings and staff. time people I'll uh, make some more videos today if this sets up we'll, uh, we'll do something else I'll hit you guys with some more Bob TV thanks for tuning in we'll see you on another the next exciting episode of Bob TV same Bob time same Bob station this episode of Bob TV was broadcasted in Philovision. This is the Drama Free Zone. <laughs>